What you're looking at here is a picture of our company founder, Mr. Hironari Oshiro, along with his U.S. advisor. Now, normally when I do these presentations, I will ask the audience, you know, if you had to guess how old would you say that Mr. Oshiro is versus his U.S. advisor, and the typical response is somewhere between 40 and 45 for Mr. Oshiro, and somewhere about 65 to 70 to his U.S. advisor. The ironic thing about this, though, is the fact that both of them are the same age. As a matter of fact, both of them will be 66 years old here in 2007. And I think we'd all agree that Mr. Oshiro has figured out a way to slow that aging process down, and uh, whereas U.S. advisor I don't think has been quite as fortunate. And I've had the good fortune to meet with, uh, with Mr. Oshiro privately, and I asked him, I said, Mr. Oshiro, you've obviously figured out a way to slow that clock down. What's your secret? He shared with me with the fact that he believes in simplicity, but also he said that if there was one unique characteristic that he could attribute to the way that he looks and the way that he feels, it's the fact that he's been drinking Kangen water for the past 15 years to the tune of about four to five liters. Now, prior to him starting in Agic, Mr. Oshiro was a major, major player with the Sony Corporation. As a matter of fact, he was one of the leading distributors in all of Japan. Now, again, because of that negative oxidation reduction potential value of the water, as a result of that, that water now has potential to become an antioxidant, anti-inflammatory properties, as well as anti-aging properties. Now, as I take you through this presentation, throughout this, we're going to actually refer you to some books. Uh, since nine months ago, since I got introduced to this, uh, to this technology, I've been reading book upon book about this technology, and it's absolutely amazing what I, what I found. Here's an interesting read. As a matter of fact, if you want validation for, t uh, for today's subject matter, this Kangen technology, this is a fascinating read written by a Korean scientist. But look at what he talks about in this book. Removing acidic waste is more effective than diet and exercise. And that's what we're going to be talking about is a technology that actually can help to flush your body and rid itself of all that acid waste that's sitting inside of us. Now, the second characteristic of this water is the fact that it has amazing microcluster technology. And you see, as this water travels through our machine, with the touch of a button, we can make five different kinds of water. Now, the benefit, one of the benefits of that as well, the water travels through there, is the fact that that water molecule cluster is broken down into, into, into it's broken down into micro clusters. And the, the importance of that is that this water, because now it's smaller size, can penetrate you at the cellular level. So it's going to hydrate you unlike any other water in the world can. And when you look at the fact that your body is comprised of 75% water, again, we all understand the importance of water. But the question again becomes what kind of water it is that we're putting in our bodies. And even the bottled waters that we've been led to believe are good for us aren't necessarily that good. So what we're suggesting is instead of drinking bottled water and the soft drinks, to simply switch to Kangen water. And again, understand our tagline, change your water, change your life, because that's what's going on for literally millions and millions of people all around the world. Here's another fascinating read written by Dr. Bat Mangalich, who happens to be an MD. And in this book, just look at the title, Your Body's Many Cries for Water. Think about what he says here. You're not sick. You're thirsty. Don't treat, medic uh, don't treat thirst with medications. And on that note, as a society, we are severely dehydrated. When you understand the fact that, on average, we only consume one quart of liquids a day, which will include your juices, your teas, your sodas, your coffees, and what little water we might get. But on the flip side is we're actually losing anywhere from two and a half to three liters of water every single day. So needless to say, if we're only putting back one quart and we're using up two and a half to three liters each day, then we're moving toward the dehydration side of that scale. And the more that your body gets dehydrated, the more problems you're going to have down the road. Now, the third property of this water is the alkalizing property that it has. And you see, we all have an ideal body temperature, which we all know is 98.6. We also have an ideal internal pH, which is 7.365. Now, what we're going to talk about here for the next minute or two is a relationship between something called acid versus alkaline. And unfortunately, because of the lifestyles that we lead, what we drink, what we eat, 
Uh, you couple that with the environment that we subject ourselves to, uh, add to that all the stress, be it emotional, be it financial, we as a society lead an acid lifestyle. And when your body's acidic, it's absolutely prone for the premature aging, the aches and the pains, the sicknesses and the, and the diseases. Now, on the flip side, what they're finding is when you can get your body pH on the slightly alkaline side, that's the perfect environment for that unlimited energy and that vitality like Mr. Oshiro, who in my mind actually is a walking billboard for what this technology represents. And before I move on, understand also, cancer now has overtaken heart disease as the leading killer in this country, and what they're finding, anyone that has cancer, invariably their bodies are loaded with acid. And on that note, what I'd like to make sure that we're all clear on here, we're not saying by drinking Kangen water that it's going to cure or treat any kind of sickness or disease. We're not saying that by any means. What we're suggesting is, is that the more of this water that you drink, the more of the acid waste your body's going to be able to flush or rid itself of. And as a result of that, you're going to help to bring your body back to that balance or that homeostasis, if you will. And as, as a result, your body itself is going to make the necessary corrections. In other words, Kangen water is one of the most vital tools that you can provide your body to make the necessary corrections that it needs to make. Now here's another fascinating read, and I think just looking at the title, Alkalize or Die, to me it summarizes it all. And this is written by a Dr. Theodore Baruti who's got some amazing credentials, but look at what he says in his book. All disease comes from the same root cause, too much acidity. And again, talking about you know why it is that we're so acidic as a society, 80% of the foods that we eat are acidic. And when you look at this list, we're not suggesting that all of those foods are bad for you. Take, for instance, blueberries and salmon as an example. We know those are good for you, but they tend to have an acidic effect on you. So the whole idea here is to drink a lot of this water because it's going to help to rid your body of that acid waste. And just look at some of these lists here over to the right of your screen. When you've got too much acidity in your body, it could lead to conditions like GERD or acid reflux, arthritis like I have fatigue, the number one complaint in doctor's offices today is lack of energy. Well guys, I mean it's impossible to have the, uh, you know, the amount of energy that you're looking for if you've got too much acid waste in your body. We talked about the fact that cancer is the leading killer in this country. Look at obesity, I mean obesity is just running rampant in our country. As a matter of fact, I mean you, all you got to do is look around you and you're going to see two or three people are overweight. And on that note, Earlier, I talked about the fact that I lost over 20 pounds of weight and all the body fat around my midsection is gone. The reason is, is because when you can rid your body of that acid waste, it ha your body then is going to naturally start to melt pounds away. And the reality is, is when you've got when you've got too much acid in you, your body actually wants to keep that fat that's sitting around your uh, stomach, as an example, to protect your vital organs from that acid waste. And as soon as you can rid your body of that acid waste, the weight just, I mean, the weight just tends to come off. And the weight loss stories that we're hearing about Kangen water are absolutely incredible. And this book, by the way, is written by Dr. Robert Young, who's a world-renowned microbiologist. But in there, there are just some fascinating before and after pictures of, you know, before somebody uh, uh, got to the alkaline side of the equation and after, and the weight loss stories are absolutely incredible. What you're looking at right now, you may not recognize his picture, but I promise you, you're going to understand what it is that he's famous for. You see, Dr. Hiromi Shinya is a world-renowned MD. He invented a procedure back in the mid-60s called the colonoscopy. As a matter of fact, he and his team, they've scoped over 300,000 colons, and I've seen some remarkable video footage with him and his team where they actually scope colon after colon after colon, and they can tell you based on what that camera shows, what kind of lifestyle you've been leading, what kind of uh, foods you've been eating, and as a result, what kind of diseases you've got going on inside of you or that you're going to be prone to. What I'm going to share with you here is just the three pictures from that DVD, and before I do that, understand Dr. Shinya is a major, major fan of our company and he's a huge time proponent of drinking Kangen water. Now, 
Take a look at some of these pictures, before and after. And, and, and I'm right here in Pennsylvania, and I promise you what you're looking at there on the left-hand side is not the sewer that belongs to this house. It's actually a picture of someone's colon. And more likely than not, that's what most people's colon looks like. And the reality...